shell the objectives. Yo, what's going on guys, Sensationalize, aka Census here, and I'm bringing you guys one of my most, or actually my best, 100 plus game that I have ever gotten in, in the W3. And yes, this is, I consider this to be better than my 139 kill game, and the reason for that is, <clears throat> well, using the M16, it is, in this game in particular, it is incredibly hard to use compared to all the other CODs. COD 4, piece of cake, they use M6, uh, Modern Warfare 2's M16, very easy to use as well. Black Ops M M16, I know a lot of you guys, uh, I've or I've heard a lot of people say that the M16 and Black Ops was kind of crappy, well, um, uh, actually that's not true. Well, at the first week when, the, the, when Black Ops first came out, the M16, like, people were one bursting people quick and stuff like it, that's how accurate it was it, it literally had no bullet spread whatsoever that's why and then they modified it then the gun was kind of shitty but it was still good to use and then they've modified it over time and then it did get better and then at, when Modern Warfare 3 uh, released they did a patch update to Black Ops and Basically what that patch of it was and what I found out of through using other guns They unpatched all of the guns that they have patched like the FAMAS It was it was, it was the FAMAS now in black ops is just like what the FAMAS was at the beginning of black ops if I am making any sense at all and You know, you know what I'm thinking right now. I'm thinking about food. I'm very hungry right now, so I'm gonna try to wrap up with this commentary as fast as possible. I'm not gonna, and I'm not gonna do any more takes because this is probably about my fifth take doing this commentary, and I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna do another one. So whatever happens, happens, and yeah. So what you wanna do using the M16 in in Modern Warfare 3, you wanna control your engagements and. What I mean by controlling the engagement is you want to have the advantage in the gunfight. And the advantages that you want to have is is the cover position. Well, that's uh, your main advantage that you need is taking cover uh, to get cover every time that you're running to certain positions. And by having that cover advantage, it's harder for the enemies to shoot you and the in the, some cases, or actually no, almost every case, excuse me, uh, you will have the advantage on your opponent. Like right there, for instance, I am hiding behind that wall. Well, not hiding, but I'm, be I'm behind that wall. He can only see my head, but I can see his whole body, so I have a large profile to shoot. Like, he was just out in the open, so that's a very easy kill right there. And, oh yeah, the second advantage that I want to tell you guys is... You want to flank. You, you need to know how to effectively flank. And how you do that is you have to know where they're spawning. And right here, well, they were spawning by the B flag. And, well, y you got to know what flags they're having. And when the UAV's up, like, see what which direction they're going on the minimap. And the direction that they're going, you want to go the opposite direction. And you want to go the opposite direction, then turn back around and follow them from from behind and that's what's called flanking well I, I think I got the definition right anyways but ba um, uh, basically what flanking means in shorter terms is shooting people in the back and uh, 
you'll see in this game yeah in this game in particular here i do shoot a lot of people in <clears throat> in the back excuse me god damn man ah <sighs> but yeah that's how you want to use the m16 so and uh, how i was feeling during this game well I actually wasn't really expecting to get 100 plus in this game in particular. Well, see, so you guys can see at the beginning of the game here that I did join a tiny bit late. Not really extremely late, but just a tad bit late. Like, we, I think we're losing 1 to 3, 1 to 4, something like that. Like, I don't know, but point is, we joined, uh, or I joined just a little late, so. And, uh, yeah, I. Didn't really get a chance to see how good the players were in here, and like when you join the random lobbies or joining games in progress, like you never know what's gonna happen. And I didn't know what's and I definitely did not know what was gonna happen in this game. <coughs> and uh, just yeah, I just rolled with the flow in this game, and it turns out I get hundred plus. So, yeah, yeah. I think that's all I have to say. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm. I think I'm not feeling as well right now because I need food. So I'm gonna stop this commentary right now. I'm gonna get my dinner and I'll bring you guys a better commentary in the next video. Oh yeah, by the way, the next video that I'm going to be showing you guys with in this series is the G36C, and. I get a large, let's just say I get a large amount of kills with the G36C in the next gameplay, so I'll be catching you guys later, and you all have a fantabulous day. Peace out. That is so gay of a Get some. 